Here we have another example of a DXF file that we want to close. Um, first thing I'm going to do is ungroup this, and then I'm going to delete these pieces that I know are not where I need them to be, or they don't even belong. And then we can see here there's also a, a second line there, so we'll delete that. All right, so far so good. We're going to grab everything. We're going to join the curves. This time I'm going to select Bezier curve, click apply, and it's going to take the 2227 objects and join them all together. And now we only have 174 objects. So what I want to do is have this these inside this inside piece filled in. So I'm going to select that all and run fill panels. Now if we notice here it hasn't filled in these bottom pieces. The reason that that hasn't filled in was because when it closed, let's go to wireframe view here and zoom in. When it closed that in, you can see that it actually closed just those lines together instead of closing it to what was behind it. So what we'll do is we'll use the virtual segment delete. We'll take out these two lines here, these two lines here, and now holding down the shift button changes virtual segment delete into join. So then we just draw a box around those, and that's all we have to do for there. Same thing over on this side. We'll just delete here, delete here, and using virtual segment delete, we will join those all together. All right. Now all we have to do is select it again, hit fill panels, and you can see that it's all filled in the way that we want it to be. We'll grab the outside, fill it in, select everything, right click, and now we have it exactly how we want it to be done.